Chatamus, 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 baby. What's good, everybody? Welcome to the stream. We have the Gabcast here. We're doing the Gabcast chat. Oh my goodness, right? Right? Ain't that fire? That's fire. We have some things to talk about. And uh, <laughs> first off, I have exciting, 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 exciting news. Exciting news. And it's not here yet, though. I'm sorry. I really, I really had to blue ball y'all like that. It's coming either next week's Gabcast or the week after. Probably the after it's probably gonna be the week eighteen Gabcast that we're gonna uh do some unveiling. And um it's very exciting. Two two one thing is it's really, really cool, and the other thing is huge, just huge, absolutely monstrous news. So without further ado, let's hop into the actual Gabcast. We're gonna, you know, take things slow. We're gonna get this uh you know, not slow, my fault. We're gonna get the ball rolling actually. It's complete opposite, my fault. I'm just tripping. Game one. From last week, week 16, was Bomb versus FC Kill Squad. Now, I couldn't make this game. If you watched the YouTube video or you watched the game as it happened, you knew that um, we had a, a special guest commentator do this game in its entirety. Shout out Chichimus Gamermus, Chichi Gamer, for the, the commentary. He called this game. And uh, while he was, you know, I don't, I don't know if he was taking it serious, he was just joking, being sarcastic, whatever. It actually added a, a, a nice little, uh, you know, contrast to the way that I do it. So it was pretty entertaining and it was pretty funny. So if you want to go watch that as well as watching a really really close good game, go to YouTube right now and look at the video. Watch the video. I pulled his stream down, edited it together and he's the lead commentator for that match. And uh other than that, Bomb and FC Kill Squad, we got uh, a team that just came into the league uh you know pretty damn decent and they are known obviously for killing. Come on now. Versus a team that is you know, still trying to rise up the rankings, but they still have that upset factor that always active. That's their that's their X factor, right? And this game, it could have gone either way. I mean, Bomb is a really, really good team. Their Jasons are really, really good. And um, the Council side, you know, does get shit done. They're sleepers. But FC Kill Squad, they have a decent roster as well. Honestly, they also could be another type of upset team. But, of course... We had Bomb take the win. Surprisingly, they sent in TJ Ur. That man just basically sent himself in. And he absolutely had an, a monstrous game versus FC Kill Squad. He did really, really well. And um, the thing the thing is, though, I do know that FC Kill Squad might have kind of, almost kind of, really actually kind of got hoed. They, they kind of did. They kind of did. The, the sweater glitched. They couldn't pop sweater and Cosby him. The Cosby, I'd say, honestly, probably had a decent chance of happening, but we will never know. We will never know. The redo wasn't given because it it was too late in the game, and uh, it was a, a GG. FC Kill Squad's J goes in. I think it was Mars, if I'm not mistaken, and he uh, bomb cooked really, really hard, actually, and won a 7 him, I'm pretty sure. Won a 7 him, and that one a 7 only came because a fill-in came by Kasami, and that's not allowed. Big no-no, so the kill counted um, just for him and not as a death for the fill-in. But anyway, so GG's the bomb for that one. Game 2. D5 and DS. Now this one was actually entertaining as well. DS actually is pretty damn good now. Like I'm not even gonna lie. Like they they have grown as a team. They've picked up a bunch of new players that they they should have. I wish they would have picked them up weeks ago, months ago. But they pick them up, and they actually <laughs> took it to D5. Especially their their J, their quarterback one. Their quarterback won good pucks. That man is on a, an inspirational run. We got good pucks. You know, the the, the, the NFL, they have Jaden Daniels, I'm pretty sure his name is, the Washington quarterback. They have the, the Caleb Mitchell guy from the Bears. They got, I know he's not new, but Kirk Cousins on, on the Falcons going stupid. Uh, Sam Darnold, shitter ass. He's not actually a fucking goat on, on the Vikings. All these players, you know, all these QBs going stupid. That's what we have right now in, in Uprising. We got good pucks here. We got you cheat a lot going on the Lance Sanity run on bomb side. We got a uh, bad ghost and Loki guard killer on, on going stupid on dynasty side. We got a, we just got a, a bunch of a bunch of Jays, a bunch of Jays going stupid, and they're basically the quarterbacks of the team in my opinion. This is not football. I know it's not football, but it's a good comparison. But D five, of course, being D five, they hold on even with good pucks. Pretty damn good game. Seraphic goes ham on DS Council side, and he wipes them, and he wins the game for D five. They are going absolutely crazy. I mean, I was so nervous. I made a bunch of mistakes against D5, brother. They were cooking. They were making mistakes. So you capitalized on them. You did a really, really good job. Unfortunately, Seraphic is just Hemi. Epic, you're you're late, but you're not 
You didn't miss anything. You didn't miss anything. We're just talking about the games real quick. Game three. Uh, by the way, GG's a D5 for the win. FM and Juggernog. This game was further away than I thought it would be. I thought it was going to be a really, really close one. But FM's J Floppa gets absolutely pummeled by Juggernog. He gets Owen'd. Juggernog actually Owen's this guy. Absolute insane match. And then I'm on the Jason side for Juggernog. Tokyo comes in and wipes the lobby. Albeit it was a bit, it was a bit tough. FM put up a really, really good fight, but it didn't matter because Tokyo is absolutely inevitable for some reason. He's just inevitable. And he wins the game, gets the wipe. All I needed was one kill, but he goes in and wipes him. About six minutes left on the clock. Slowish, but hey, it's a wipe. We'll take that. So GG to Juggernaut for the win. Uh, tough game for Floppa. I mean, it's J8 Higgins Large, though. So, I mean, Juggernaut has a stacked-ass counter team. So what can you really do? What can you really do? Game four, D&D &D and CLK. Now, this one was spectacular. And, of course, you're looking at the screen now, and you're like, well, CLK won this, right? Nope, they didn't. D&D &D won. That man Fruity went stupid, and it wasn't just Fruity this time. You know, a couple wins in the, in, the, in the past few weeks, you could say, well, it really was Fruity, like against Juggernaut, D and D beat Juggernaut. Crazy, I know. You can be like, oh, Fruity, you know, he he was a he was a lead, he was a leader for that. This time around, CLK is a higher ranked team, actually, and um, D and D actually went stupid on the council side against Little Man, Little Man CLK J. Absolutely crazy shit. They, I think they only they two a seven him. They two a seven Little Man. And, and uh, Fruity went 6 of 7 or 5 of 7 or something like that, I think. Yeah, 5 of 7. My goodness, bro. And, you know, granted, CLK's counter side kind of sold. They did kind of sell, but, I mean, shit. It didn't matter because D&D &D counter side came into play, and they did that exact thing. That was an amazing match from them. GG's a D&D. &D. Tough loss for CLK. Tough loss. At this point, they've lost the last three weeks, so they have to find something. They have to find something. We don't know. We're going to pretend that they didn't just win tonight. Um, they have to they have to do something different. They have to do something different. They have to figure it out now because they don't want to lose their seating spot. They don't want to do that. But GG's a D and D game five last game, BLP and Dynasty. This one was uh this one was a uh, uh, I think it was written in the books the moment that it happened. BLP, absolutely, just monstrous game on either on every single aspect. Jason wiped them fastest wipe and one of the fastest wipe we've seen in Uprising history. Thirteen fifty five left on the clock. Reach wipe seven to seven. They Owen the Dynasty J. It was Guard Killer. He sent they sent him in. Guard Killer goes 0 7. They kill him with like a minute 47 left on the clock. Ay ay ay. BLP. Someone someone has to stop BLP, bro. It's like Thanos. It's prime Thanos in the league. Everyone else in the league is just the Avengers, bro. We have to fucking do something. We have to do something because they ever since I made that 4 4 comment, ever ever since the 4 4 comment was made in general, I think I wasn't the only one that said it. They have been undefeated, untouchable. D5 fell to them. CLK fell for them. I fell to them. Fell for them. AO. Fell to them. Every team is falling to them right now. It's insane. They beat AT when AT was back in the league. So, so we glazing. I'm not glazing. I'm not glazing. I'm not a BLP fan for say, but I mean, I got to respect game when I see game. They're going stupid, brother. And I mean, if we're talking about this this, uh, this team right now, well, we're going to talk about it in, more in a second, actually. Let me just stop. BLP stealing the win away. Going a complete landslide. A landslide. No, in the CLK match, when I have a speaker in my lobby, I just get nervous and make too many mistakes. Dude, I'm not, I'm not, you know, I'm, I'm hyping you up and I'm hyping the town, the team up that you're going against at the same time. I'm hyping y'all all up. Now, come on now, just lock in and show, show something on the, you're on the stage right there. Right then and there, you're on the stage, you're in front of, pretend you're in front of, well, I was going to say pretend you're in front of a million people, but that probably wouldn't help. I mean, you're on, you're on the grandest stage of them all. So you just got to show something, brother. You got you to be great. You got to be him. You got to show why you're, you're there. You got you to gotta prove, prove that you, you belong there. So. Anyway, GG's to BLP. Let's hop into the Players of the Week for Week 16. Epic. The Council of the Week Award for Week 16 goes to none other than Epic Lucius. Now, you guys are like, why the fuck didn't Lyles get it? Because he was doing all the cleans. Yeah, I do understand that. But cleans, like, again, we had, I had this exact conversation with someone else that was asking why they didn't get higher overall for cleans. Cleans are cool. But they're not going to give you Council of the Week unless, you know, you're, you're ab actively... Also taking chase. Like Silly back uh, back a few weeks ago against Fruity, actually. He got a bunch of cleans, and he earned the Council of the Week Award, one of the three. Uh, last week, actually. He he uh, won one of the three Council of the Week Awards, but he also was getting tunneled. He was also taking tunnel, taking chase, getting limped, healing, saving people. So he was playing really well. Jay Lyles, you know, he was doing a mad damage. But he wasn't really getting chased. You know who was getting chased the whole game? This man right here. Epic Lucius, escaping in the car, came back as Tommy for the kill, 
This man came back with, I think, maybe like 15 minutes left. And from 15 minutes all the way down to 147 left on the clock, this man was taking the tunnel from Guard Killer. Not one moment did this man... No, Guard Killer wasn't even slashing anybody else. He was just slashing this guy right here, and yet he lived. And I had to give it to him because last time that he was in this predicament, he came back as Tommy after escaping. They were on the way to a one seven, or uh, on the way to an one on a Jason. It was game sheet, and he couldn't hold on. And he was the only one that died to him, and he ruined the Owen. Now I'm not saying that he's a shitter. Of course not. He's really, really good. That's why he's Council of the Week this week. But this is like a comeback type of week. You know what I'm saying? He comes back and he he writes that wrong, and he survives. He took the aggro tunnel off the whole game after he came back. And he is also the reason why uh, they got the kill. Big game, big win, huge. Counts of the week right here, baby. Let's go. You're welcome. Thank you, Epic. Thank you. Everybody, shout out Epic in the chat. You, you know damn well I deserve counts of the week. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe I'll 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 look back at your game and see, and I might give you a second. I might I might give you a second. I might give I might give a second Council of the Week award. I might see. I might see. But right now, that's the Council of the Week, the only one. J of the Week. Yes, I mean I said it earlier. Thirteen fifty five. My God, man, it's obviously Reach. Reach. Forty demise. Seven to seven with thirteen minutes and fifty five seconds. Bro, five seconds earlier on the last kill, and he would have had a six minute fucking wipe. This is a six oh five wipe. What the fuck? Bro, he barely just got stalk on the J on the J eight. Come on now, kept his mask, speed wipe, thirteen points scored, win versus Dynasty. Jason of the week instantly goes to voted demise, voted demise, ninety nine overall. He didn't even need the five overall boost from the J of the week. He was already ninety nine. He was ninety nine before the game began. He was he was ninety nine overall before the game even started. He was ninety nine a week ago. But he got 99 overall still because of the fucking bro. That'd be a that'd be if he was 92, this would be a 99 game, because he'd go 94 for the two point boost plus five for the J of the week 99. He's him, brother. He's him. He's him. And of course, you guys know it. They're doing it again. Someone has to stop these fucking people, dude. I can't take it anymore. <laughs> I can't. Team of the week goes to big long poachers. Jason, of course, obviously went seven to seven. He they owe a seven their opponent. You should have gave Spacey Council Week for getting booted. True, true. True, true. Back to back team of the week. You could have, you should have, you could have, you should have, but BLP survived longer. They had they, they ran the time down shorter. So if y'all would have just STN'd on on the on Flaba, it would have been a W for y'all, but damn, they, they went to the one forty seven mark. Sixth team of the week award, by the way. By the way, this is week sixteen and at at this point, and in sixteen weeks they won six Overall, all right, six team of the week awards. They have the exact same thing on Harjay. I might give y'all a dual team of the week then. I'm, I'm, I mean, come on, I know I wanted to give y'all team of the week. I was correct for y'all to get team of the week because BLP must be stopped. But I, I can't, I can't, I can't hoe them. So, you know, good SD that Jay. Don't say that about my goat. Don't say that about my goat guard killer. What the fuck is wrong with you? Huh? Why would you say that? That's not cool. Don't say that again. I look at it. I'll see, uh, I'll see, Rev I'll see, uh, I'll look into Rev's uh, gameplay, Revenants. And then I'll look into uh, giving y'all a dual team of the week. I know you might be right. You might be right. You might be. But, hey, I mean, come on. That's all based on stats. It's all based on stats and how the, the numbers. We're crunching the numbers. That's all it is. Anyway, you guys, this is the best part of the, the, best part of the stream. We're going to get into the top ten. It has become it – is, it has underwent an entire overhaul. A complete overhaul has been given to it. Um, I'm not going to lie. I mean, come on, come on, brother. And I'm, I'm going to say this. I think that Dynasty should have sent Bagos in. I ain't going front. Oh, that man Bagos is clean. That man Bagos is nasty. I'm just messing. Don't waste your time. I don't mean waste your time. I'll, I'll go back and watch it. I like. I haven't watched a single game back other than to, you know, watch the game back for, to see, like, certain shit happen, like who got the stat here or whatever, like a D-mask or something, or get the count points. I haven't actually, like, rat, really sat down and rewatched the game for fun yet because I'm waiting until the league's over to do it. But... I'm just saying, I'm just saying though. Back to the, what I was just saying. If they would have sent that man back, I was saying, bro. I don't know. It's like they 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 edging me. They're edging me. They they gave me bad ghosts that one week, and he went stupid. And then they haven't given him back to me since, unfortunately. Anyway, top ten. By the way, top ten. Let's lock in. Um, is, again, a, a complete overhaul. Un, like overhaul is completely different. I mean, the the okay, I will say this: the sounds are the same, but everything else is completely different. It looks clean as fuck. 
Let me know what y'all think. Maybe I have to change it. Maybe you guys don't like it. I'll cry if you don't. But uh, so you can keep my present going on PC. Yeah, true. Do that. Okay, let's lock in, baby. I'm gonna shut up now so you can watch this top 15. Enjoy. I hope you guys like it. I spent a whole night working on this, like I do every week, and uh, it was very fun though because this top 14. I'll spoil it right now. It's only 14 because we only had 14. It's really good. Really good. We already get the leak starting on PC. We was a day late. Crazy. Okay, I'm gonna shut up now. Good luck. Uh, not good luck. Have fun. Enjoy. We'll see it started with three people in there. Three people and Seraphic just broke down the house and he's thinking about morphing. He morphed at the front. Are they going to speed past them? No, they are not. They see the fence and they said, you know what? I need to drive into that real quick. In the distance, shift down on the chad. And he blocked the air. And no spray cancel. Oh, oh, fully spray. Should have done a heavy. Should have done a heavy. For a while, he is now awake. And oh, clean heavy, and his mask is still on up. Oh, shift bat by Good Pucks, who is, um, you know, void right now. So. <laughs> Oh, that's a big hit by Bugsy. And they are throwing crackers so far away that they really don't want to use them. They are gone. See you later, firecrackers. Shot. A possibility. Oh, no, he really did get shot. Right. Well, he needs a weapon. Yeah, there we go. And they go for the free. Oh! Why won't you fucking die? Oh, the R1 tech. Oh, clean. I'm pretty sure that was a clean. Oh, Adam is the sacrifice right now. Oh, mask is still on though. But huge hits because that Bugsy uh, acts it early on too. That that was huge. Oh, another clean. Oh, he didn't even block it. Why didn't he block it? Oh shit, he's gonna die. Oh, Adam there with the bat too. Oh, <laughs> all right. Well. Adam is one, and he still lost <laughs> that. They drop weapons. They have two flare guns. Oh, that flare gun, huge! It shifts down. You can. Oh, that's another flare gun shot, though. Another chippy, chippy damage. Done. Ooh, it's still not. It's still on. Why? Why are they using the bat? Why are they using the bat? They shouldn't be using the bat. Don't they want to save it? Unless someone has sucker. Ooh, great hits by Firecracker though. Great hits by Firecracker. Oh, he's won. Tommy is dead. G, G. Are they gonna get the mask? There we go. There we go. All right, Tommy, get up. Come on, Tommy, get up and kill. Because they just had four straight. Bro. Like no team did that, bro. A uh, nice limp there. This is looking like it. Oh my God! Why don't you grab him though? Baby girl. Nice, he got a kill now. The arrow is dead now. Oh, oh my god, is it here? You grab this motherfucker. Never mind, you slash him. No! It's all over. Oh no. Uh, GG. GG. GG DD. I told you, I was like, I'm feeling it. Yo, DD might win this game because of that sell. CLK Council said just sold. You have the car for that, and everyone's gonna have to let me kill you now because that was mean. My feelings are hurt. Never mind. A nice overhead swing to the back of the neck from. Hold on. We're gonna go for another overhead swing to the back of the neck. Meek! And another stun. Tommy, it's your job again. Don't. You hope it's done. You better stun. Venus with another one to the back of the neck. My goodness. Now you play that again. They got no sweater. Why not? And another one, and that's gonna be the D mask. Oh my god, no D mask. Axe breaks. Give me a weapon. 
Tommy has to run away for a gun. This is bad. Or a weapon. This is bad. Yeah, yeah. Now you have to go for a gun save. They're forcing the gun save. This could be a TK if he's not careful. Take oh, the demask from Little Man to get it, but he's got no weapon now. And to, oh my God, now he's getting back in the car. That's not the play. You might be dead. Weapon right behind you. Weapon right behind you. Tommy coming in last second with a fucking piece of wood. Gets the stun. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, the pipe is right there. Oh my god, I can't believe this. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. Pulling Kenny out now. Give me this shit, baby. Yes, they finally found the pipe. No, they didn't find the pipe. Another stun with the 2x4. Tommy legged that bitch all the way back. Finally, no, the pipe is right there, chat. Oh, another hit, but it doesn't stun that time. Stun. Oh. Corrupt the Bugsy, and he is dead. I think it's Firecracker. It is Firecracker. It is dead. He nearly shift grabbed the house. Nearly. It was really close. But here we go. Chad just unlocked the door. Is he gonna get knife grabbed? Wait, it was one. Oh, his leg is hurt. Look at that leg. It's like the trap, and he's like, shit, he's back. And he's getting slammed in the head. Ouch. Headache in the morning. Bat is now destroyed. Oh, he's, he's limp now. He's limp now. Why is he not blocking? He's not blocking. Uh oh. You're gonna have to spray. Anyone gonna spray? Oh, he is dead, bro. Tommy is dead. For real? I mean, it's really far into the game, but like. I, I don't know. Like, let's say fix the triangle button. Yeah, this is the first game. Jason first. I understand the redo is only staying there. Oh, okay, okay. And dead. I didn't see the time. Crap. Wait. Put on the J8. Yeah, this might be a. If he, if he goes crazy, he might get a. Oh, 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 oh. oh. That's huge. No, get the chat, bro. Get the chat, baby. What you doing? Yes. Yeah, oh, nice. Oh, I was nice. Oh, that was so nice. Kim, I kill him now. Oh my god, don't die. Don't, don't, don't let him, don't let him live. Kill that motherfucker. Fuck oh my god, baby, don't, don't, don't let him spray. Oh my god, you're getting, you're getting cooked. Yes, 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 he's dead, he's dead. Yes, yes, now you're not getting that. Don't let him stun you. No! Why did you do that? Oh my god, good pucks, please lock in, bro. You have to kill these guys now. He's running away, get him, shift, do something. Kill him now. What are you opening that door for? He's not, he's gonna make it. Oh god. Just kill yourself, Gucci. It's over. Oh, oh, nice. That's a kill, baby. Come on, now wrap this up. Clean it up, man. Oh, sit down, shift down, shift on this biatch. Oh my god, a grab instantaneously. PK though, I would have. Yo, now it's up the freaky seraphic and Gucci back as Tommy, right? Yeah, Gucci's back as Tommy. He's gonna. Oh my god, shoot me. Oh, you're so ass, Gucci. Gucci just sold his teammate. Oh my god, the shotgun just doesn't even come close to connecting. That's nice. The slash. Nope. Come on, baby. Uh, oh my god, he's double edging. You get his ass. Yep, meek. Block. Oh. Nice dodge. Dodge again. Rose is dodging. Rose on that Rhea. Rhea attack. Oh, another slash on the freaky. Has the knife, but he misses the knife. Oh my god, it's over. Say goodbye to Thomas, gamer. Oh my god. No shot. He's going, going stupid. Freaky is cooking right now. Let him, let him cook. We're gonna morph. Oh, we're gonna morph. We're gonna morph right behind him. Damn. We're in a tree. Freaky, what the fuck are you doing? Nice. No, bro, that's overall. That's overall getting siphoned out of him. There's no one around. Oh, someone in the house, maybe. Oh, you're cooked. Oh, never mind. He's gonna pop the firecrackers. He's safe. That's SBP Heart Mirror. Knife to the face. My goodness, bro. He's got your booty right where he wants it too. Uh oh. He's got shift up for sure. Be careful! He's trying to go over the knife grab, misses it. Bro's just walking around, like literally just jogging out. Okay. I don't like it, bro, bro. It's really bad. He's gonna go to the phone now. Morphing to phone. You're getting combo bombo. You're cooked. Shoot, shoot him. He gets the shot to go. Tokyo saves his own life there with the flare gun. Sprays up right after. I don't know. Another shift coming. Now he's going back to the group at the... Oh, gets the save to go. Nice stuff, nice stuff, nice stuff. They're calling. I have to stop them. And we got the cop call off. Oh, I'm just going to cover that booty now. Slash coming. 
Gets the combo to go. No, he's using the knife grabber. But that's been Big Man Tokyo with the save. Downtown huge. Oh my God. He's got to walk these people out. Come on, I ripped you. Don't sell. You get to walk all your boys out. All of them. And almost gets grabbed there. Yikes. Oh my God, he does get grabbed. Save me. Gets the stun. Don't spam grab though, baby. Oh, he's trying to spam grab. He's not going to. He tried to. 650. 650. Oh, a 7. GG. Another slash into the air. He baited that. That's a clean for Bugsy. Okay, Chaos. Nice job opening him up, that duo. Just keep Tunnel on Thomas. Block that shit. Hit him. R1 tech him. Oh, he has a free clean from Lyles. Oh, my God. Tommy, come here. I need you. Yes, sir. Oh, no. Bugsy clean with a fucking piece of wood. Okay. Oh, yeah. clean. Oh, a clean from Chad there, bro. Lucky ass here from Jigs. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Slash coming right there. Oh, both of them. Oh, blocked that. I don't know if that was a clean or not. The, the hand might have been up. I don't know. That's a block. Bro's just spamming. Bro's just R2, R, R2 spamming. Okay. I'm shitting all over him. These are free limbs. Shift coming. Tommy was free right there. Oh, that was a nice ass clean. Yikers. Nice clean there from Lyles. Lyles is trying to... Okay, that was sad. I'm gonna do something. And I'm saying, just landed on these guys that are running up to you to hit you. Hit that motherfucker now, man! Oh, D Mask can't. He does get the, the D Mask credit. Oh, God. Okay, first shift coming finally. Shifting far to them. We're gonna just go straight on the Bugsy grab. Tiffany is. What the fuck are we doing? Well, he doesn't know. He's gonna stay on the Tiffany. Interesting. Gets the slash to go on Tiffany. Gets a second one to go. Gets a third one to go if he would just slash there. Oh, he's got a knife combo. Chad's gonna get the spray. Oh, he doesn't get the spray. This might be a wrap. Keep blocking. Oh my god, we're hitting my teammate. But I'm gonna hit him with a pipe. Call it. He's still not sprayed. How did he not get sprayed when two people sprayed him? Grab time. I feel it coming. He misses the grab. Okay, Venus, you're so booty, bro. Oh my god. Kitty, can he save? No. Okay, Venus, that was terrible. Gabe Sheet also getting there. Venus sold the game. Now Troll is out of. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, yeah. Throw that. Oh, that's a grab. No PK. It's over. 447. 447. Come on. There's more fun. Yeah, he's dead. He's dead as fuck. He's cooked. Yeah, say goodnight. Come here, sick Bruin. And I'm going to eat you alive. And GG's. Juggernogs with the W. I don't know what's happening, but I'm getting cooked. It's 708. Shit, nice grab on the Rhea. Nice, bro. He's actually cooked. Both fill-ins are gone. Fill-ins can be Tommy, remember. God, he got Tommy. I guess I just had to let it happen because it's both fill-ins dead. Oh, no. Him and, okay, never mind. Sick Bruin. And Bryce is dead. Okay, Sick Bruin, leave. Sick Bruin, leave. If Bruin leaves, then Bryce can be Tommy. Bryce is dead. What is going on? Okay, I grab you. Now you're fucked. Let's get in the car, guys. Everyone hop in the car and let's go. He's dead. He's dead. Flop is gone. No, don't actually don't leave though. Don't actually leave though. No, no, don't leave though. Don't, don't leave though. Don't leave. Oh my God, Tokyo got the stop on this guy. <laughs> it's a wrap, baby. Say good night. Say good night. Say good night. LOL, 69 to 20 is now cooked too. <sighs> I'm gonna just insta choke you. I get into the wrong door. Oh fuck me. They're playing until dawn, and we're just killing everyone. And a grab onto. Did I do that? No PK. He get bro's trying to go for this thing. He thinks it's FPL. Trying to go for four different kills. Now, just land a shift grab, brother. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 602 GG. Thank you guys for watching. Good game to Jugs for the win here. 602. Bye bye. Ben, look. They're actually pushing for this car. Everyone is pretty much here apart from the other Nestler. Oh, he is stunned. Yeah, this is still first off. Uh, this spacey is somewhere right now, and he's getting comboed. And one more slash, and he is dead. And his arm went flying. Oh my god, look at that arm right over there. Just three minutes in. About two and a half minutes, I think. But... Shifting on the fox. PK? 
No PK and dead. Kigglebot. And the Debbie said, let me steal your weapon real quick. Three sprays at the car. I think. Should do. Just chill. Nice one on the Debbie. And shift in. Oh, evades one. Oh, is he gonna dodge back? Dodge back? Dodge back? Spray? No spray? No spray for the Debbie, who is iron. Iron with a good net right now, though. And it is actually iron, so. Are they gonna take this trap? We just ran right through the trap. Oh, no. I think that's GG. Unless they buy time for cops, they could buy time for. No weapons. Kill on a thought on your head. Who's been doing really well this game? Hit. Two knives gone though, so he did have knives. I don't know if he still has any more. He might do. Ooh, Nessa said, I'm gonna wait behind. Um, you guys go without me. Um, I'm just gonna stay right next to this wall real quick. But if they evade a grab. Nope. Uh, cops here, that's the main question. Are they here? No. It's kind of mid. I'll give you that. Oh, he tried to go for a hit. I think he's lost down though, and he's dead. 636. 636. Dead. GG. GG, GG, GG. Leave that car. Oh man. Oh, it's a combo coming. Yes, get the kill right now. Firecrackers. God damn. He's gonna have to lock the fuck in. They're they're they still haven't brought anybody they haven't got the two seater out yet. Okay, Jed and Arrow escape, Jed's Tommy. Nice save to go. You wanna vote one for there? There's another option for both MVJ and MVC. Ship coming slash combo, but a nice save by Fruity prematurely. Nice stun there. They're cooking, bro. I think it might be a wrap. Do that, but it's just gonna go by over. Oh my god, he missed the shotgun. Jed. Now nah, you're get oh Jed Adaya. Jed! Oh my god, nice he saves his life. Fruity with a nice combo. Now on to Feisty. Get out of my way. Yeah, hit your teammate for me. Oh, Fruity's gonna get another save again. Fruity's playing Doctor. Flash there, but they're gonna get the spray to go. Grabs her to stop. Oh, nice stun from Tommy though. That's like alone, really. Like, people, they could do that. Nice grab on the Tommy again. Oh, but the stun from the fucking pipe onto them. My god, we're still stunning him. Candidly, that's just me. I'd vote for the person that I really think deserved it out of all teams. Nice grab again on the Tommy. Another stun coming from KTC. A fucking tree branch. Oh my god. Okay, now you're on the road though. Misses the grab. Oh my god. Oh my god. She's gonna get. No, Stam. No. Overhead. Swing this man. Swing this man. Swing him. PK. She has a PK. Yeah, she has a PK. She's. No, just go, go, go. You have a PK. No, you do. He's scared. Oh my god. He has... She has a PK. Yes, she does. Oh my god. <laughs> the emote. Six minutes flat. Oh my goodness. I... Balls off on that uh, hot spot. Shifting inside the house. Now you're all alone. Get grabbed. TPK on Eastpedia. No PK. Eastpedia is dead first. Yeah, bro's greedy as hell. Let's back up. Let's back it up. And we get stopped. And we have to be careful. We're pulling him right out. Let me just bonk you over the head right there. Peek. Oh, no stun. That's cheating. Oh, he's fucked. Say goodnight. Oh, we're going to team kill, my friend. Oh, my God. No spray for me. Oh, I'm dead. Why didn't I spray all my letters dead? Now this person's also dead, Rooney. No PK. Ay, ah, yeah, ay, yeah. ay. Vito could not save them. That's, that's, that's not what you want to see. They got the point for the, the car started, but, but now we're kind of getting, getting cooked. Yeah, now a knife to the back of Vito. Can Vito stay alive against Reese right now? Oh, he's spraying right there in front of him. What is his brother doing? Nice block. Nice block. Combo coming. He's cooked, but Vito is dead. Oh my goodness graciousness. Down to the goats though. Bad ghost and guard killer. They're hemis. They're both hemis. Oh man, a limp on them with no spray because all of them are, all the sprays over there at the car. You have a spray for me? Oh, shifting out of it. Grabs me and now I might be dead too. 1355 wipe. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god. Yes, yeah. Bad ghost the goat. Bad ghost, bad ghost, bad ghost, bad ghost, bad ghost. I want more bad ghost.
I need bad ghosts. Bad ghost gameplay would save and feed so many generations. Okay, chat. We have uh, to talk about the games, actually. My fault. I'm on the website. I'm trolling. The games for this week. First game up on the board is <laughs> DS and CLK. This game actually just happened, but we're going to pretend it didn't. This game is actually interesting. CLK coming off of a three-loss streak, I'm pretty sure. They have to lock in because uh, they don't want to lose their place in the seating. They uh they didn't want to lose their place in the seating, so they're gonna beat DS. And I mean, looking at DS's track record, it should be a free win. But again, DS's team has gotten a lot better in the last two or three weeks. I don't know how, I don't know when, but they just did. And they have good pucks at the helm. This is very possible for another upset. DS might be becoming the new upset team. Who knows? They have been playing really well, actually. Um, I do think that CLK, with the addition, a uh, re-addition of Game Sheet finally coming back out of the woodwork, that they're gonna take this win. Um, they're gonna do it. Uh, close? I don't know. I don't know if it'll be a close game. I don't. I don't think it. It will be. Um, but then again, you never know because Good Pucks has been doing an absolutely amazing job. So if Good Pucks has a really good Jason game, Dream Savers, all they have to do is just pop off and have a good game versus uh, whoever they send as Jay. If his game sheet going to be a, a bit tough, going to be a bit tough. His little man still going to be a bit tough. Game little man coming off of a tough game, but I mean. I think that he'll bounce back. It's J5 Pinehurst. It's a really, really good map. Really, really good J. Um, hey, bad words, guys. Bad words, guys. Bad words. No bad words. I think that CLK takes his win, though. CLK and CLK and four. CLK and four. Final. CL, CLK and four. Um, GG's. GG's. Uh, I think it's going to go to CLK. Um, and we'll see. We already saw. Uh, game two. Juggernaut and Bomb. This one's actually very interesting. Uh, the last time we saw these teams go at it, I think, Juggernaut took the win. We might see a bomb win this time, especially if they send that man you cheat a lot. Um, you cheat a lot kind of going stupid this season. He's having a breakout season, to be honest. Um, then again, you have Juggernaut Counterside, who's coming off of a big fat Owen and maybe even a possible team of the week snub. Um, I think they're going to they're gonna go crazy. I think they're angry. They're, they're going to be very, very mad, very, very upset, and they're going to take it out on bomb. And I think that Juggernauts are going to win this game. Just the council side alone, because of the the snub. Now, of course, the Jugs send in Tokyo or Moody or maybe even Rifty. I don't know. I don't think it'll. I don't think it'll matter. I don't think it'll matter because the ta the council team for Juggernaut is going to go crazy. Then again, you cheat a lot is on the insanity run, and the, he he went stupid against BLP. So, um, yeah, I think that it's going to be a close one. I think it's going to be a close one. The upset team versus a, a sleeper team. That shouldn't even be a sleeper team because they're top tier. Chuggernog wins. Is there going to be a special guest on your Gabcast next week? I think so. I think so. We just have to get, uh, we had to get it set up, brother. <clears throat> we had to get it set up. But I think that I think that there should be. I think that there should be. Maybe even maybe even week eighteen as well. Maybe even week eighteen as well for the unveiling of some things. Who knows? Um, Chuggernog wins this game. Game three. Uh, and by the way, yeah, game two, the, the Juggernaut and Bomb game is tomorrow at 7, I think, 7. And then this game is also tomorrow at 8, Dynasty versus D5. Lord, I'm begging you. I'm looking up to you right now. I'm begging you. I'm praying to you right now. Give me a bad Ghost Jason match right now. Give me a bad Ghost Jason match. Give me, give the league a bad Ghost Jason match. We need bad Ghost. Bad Ghost is our only hope. Bad Ghost is our only hope to win against D5. Bad Ghost, we have, to, we have to rely on the man. It's J5 Pinehurst. Give it to Bad Ghost. D5. I think D5 is just going to win this anyway. Because it's D5. D5 has to be stopped. If, if D5 wins FPL and Uprising, oh, God. Then again, Bad Ghost is heavy. And I, I think that Bad Ghost is number one Jason right now. So, And they have Joe Cini. Yeah, they, and then they have Joe Cini. I simply cannot decide. Mm-mm-mm. -mm -mm. I think we're going to go with D5, though. I think we're going to go with D5, just a little bit of an edge. I mean, Dynasty is going to really take it to Oh! I actually exited out of the screen. Dynasty is really going to take it to him. But D5 with Seraphic at the helm. And then they got the Counter Squad. My God, that Counter Squad is so sexy, bro. I ain't going to lie. GG's to D5. GG's to D5. GG's to D5. Game 4 at 9 p.m. Eastern on Saturday tomorrow is D&D versus FCK. This is, might be a game of the week. Potential. Uh, we have Fruity on the D and D side going into shape for sure against FC Kill Squad. Now that man FC, they, he's gonna want Fruity's head. They're gonna do everything in their power to do it. They should have had it last week, I think. To be honest, versus uh, TJR. But uh, Fruity, I'm gonna have to time you out, brother. I'm gonna have to time you out. To be honest. Um, but again, 
Um, I think that uh, Fruity is going to have another great game. Fruity is just locked in. He's been locked in the last few weeks of our uprising. If only he was locked in um, for uh, FPL playoffs versus FPLP. <laughs> He's locked in. And uh, FCK, uh, they lost Hoodie Batman. So now they're going to send in uh, uh, maybe Firecracker. Oh, yeah, they're going to definitely send in Firecracker. Firecracker going against, going against D&D. This is going to be a good match. I think that, I think, oh, I don't know. That's tough. Hey, everybody, stop dude, Stop kissing in the chat, man. Damn. Stop kissing in the chat. Anyway, I think that, uh, I think D&D is going to win this game. I think it's going to be, I think Fruity. Fruity is going to do everything in his power to win the game again for D&D. And he's, he's, he's going stupid. Now, D&D last week also had a great breakout game versus Little Man. And the Little Man's a top, uh, top tier J. I would say top top five in the league right now because you got Reese, Seraphic, uh, you got, um, Fruity, you got Tokyo, you got uh, Bad Ghost, <laughs> you got Game Sheet. I mean, yeah, but, but, um, um, who knows, bro? Who knows? Who knows? Trolls a bot. How are you selling against Good Pucks? Okay, can you guys relax? Can you guys relax? Good Pucks is top tier. I ain't gonna lie. He's top tier. But they still played really well against Little Man anyway. They did. So I think that they could have another breakout good game, and it's going to be against the Firecracker. I don't know if there's bad blood here or not. I don't really know, but who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Okay, Rhea. Rhea. Just calm down, guys, please. Thank you. Uh, GG's a D&D here, I think. Uh, I'm going to give it to that. BLP and FM is the final game. It's Sunday, 7.30 p.m. Eastern. BLP wins. BLP is just never going to stop, I don't think. I don't think they're going to stop. I don't think that anything can stop them until playoffs where people lock in and have the ban phase help them, hopefully. BLP is just on a generational run. They haven't lost a game since week uh, 8. They haven't lost a game since week 8. It's week 16, going into week 17. They haven't lost since week 8. They haven't lost since week 8, chat. That's, I mean, D5 had a longer, a longer win streak, but, I mean, bruh, it's since week 8. They haven't lost. They're on their way. My goodness. BLP wins this game. FM going to have to rely on Floppa. Floppa had a really good game against D5, and I think D5 edges BLP just a little bit. <laughs> edges. Um, but can he do it against BLP? I don't know. I don't know. And FM's counter team, they're going to they're gonna have to They're gonna have play stupid. They did really good against Tokyo, but just, I mean, Floppa got 0-1 last week against Jug, so one death to Tokyo would have just sealed the game, and that happened ultimately led to, lead to a wipe. If they could play that well, it may be even better against uh, Reach. Possible win. Possible win. But we'll have to see. Um, I think BLP is going to take this, though. I think they're going to take this for sure. And uh, we're going to see tomorrow or two, in two days. In two days. Now, for the website. Guys. <clears throat> nothing will beat PR20 Rundo. Nah, actually, Baden, real men's run and undefeated run and two leagues. Oh, wait, no. It wasn't a completely undefeated run in the second league, but it, it carried over. Undefeated in one league, carried over to the next league, kept being undefeated. I think we surpassed 20 game win, win record. So I don't know, man. I don't know. But then again, Triple A went 32 and one. They had 32 win streak, 32 win streak. So and that was at the beginning of time in tournaments. And then they and then guess who beat them, guys? Y'all never guess who'll beat them. Uh, most of y'all already know. You should know. Who was the first person to give Triple A their their first Triple A TL their first loss? Yours truly, yours truly, baby. Yours truly did it. Of course I did it. Come on now, I was I was the best player ever. I was the best player ever. We don't talk about Xbox here. Um, Xbox doesn't matter. This is the PS4 League. PS5. No, I'm kidding. All right. Uh, oh, yeah. Let me refresh the page for y'all. <laughs> here y'all go. Team of the Week, Jason, the Week, Council of the Week. They, they three-peated. Uh, not three-peated. They, uh, they, they did a uh, trifecta. Yeah, that's what it is. Trifecta this week. Trifecta. Crazy. Stat leaders. We got Seraphic in the lead in the league with 86 kills. 86 touchdowns. 86 touchdowns. He's, he scored 86 touchdowns. Uh, what a demise. Has led his team to seven wins. Wipes. Uh, or not okay. We can't say that. Seven wipes. He's a. Uh, what would what would be what would be a good comparison? Um. I don't know. I guess I'll do seven blowouts. Seven blowouts. Seven blowouts. Uh, absolute crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. Uh, what a demise leading the league in wipes. Seraphic assassin leading. Now look at this. Two one. Uh, Seraphic here. Seraphic here. Reach here. Reach here. Look at this. Now. Seraphic leading the league in wins is Jason. 13 wins. 13 wins. And then Reish. He just got Jay of the Week again. This is his third Jason of the Week award this season. <clears throat> his third Jason of the Week. 
brother. My goodness. My goodness. Counselor wise, we have avoided demise. <laughs> Again. Leading the league in survivals is counselor with fifteen. Fifteen survivals throughout sixteen weeks. If he didn't fill in, you would you would you would you know you would think, hmm, this guy, he's survived every week except for one. But there's fill in games, there's games where I think he I don't think he's been Tommy though. I don't think he's been Tommy once. And I know all the games he's never died early or or escaped early enough to come back as Tommy because he he survives till the end of the game. Every time. Or dies at the end of the game. Or he, one time against the Cheetah Lot, he died early, but didn't get Tommy. Got unlucky. <clears throat> anyway, 15 survivals. Leading the league. No one else has that many. Little Man is leading the league in Jason Kills. He's either Tommy or Sweater. He has participated in three deaths. He's murdered three Jasons. He's participated in three murderings of Jasons. Huge. Reaper Rifty with three D-Masks. He's leading the league in D-Masks. That man likes doing damage. That man likes to... He might have a little bit of drink on, on game day. I don't know. And he gets a little abusive. No, I'm kidding. He goes stupid. Takes that mask. Takes that mask. And then BMSZW is leading the league in Counselor of the Week Awards because he has two. He has two of them. Baden making an appearance. Question mark? Yes, Sereski. So these are your league leaders right now. On the Jason side, one more time. And on the counselor side, one more time. Two, three. Speaking of, now we have the schedule. Players of the week. Chat, All-Stars. I don't think we're going to do an All-Stars week, actually. So I'm sorry. I don't think we're going to do an All-Stars week. MVP voting. Voting is live. This page will be updated once MVP voting is done. Do exclamation point vote in the chat, and you can get the link to go vote for your favorite player or... Not your favorite player. Let's not do that, guys. Vote for who you think actually deserves it. Let's do that. Because that's what we do. Vote for your most valuable counselor, most valuable Jason, and the most valuable team. Right now. Exclamation point. Vote. Not MVP. Exclamation point. Vote. V-O-T-E, brother. There you go. There's the form. Go fill it out, baby. Go fill it out. It's going to ask you for your email to sign in because only one vote submission per person. But we don't track your emails. I promise you. Or maybe we do. You'll never know. Predictions, power rankings, they're updated for week 16. Week 17 just began to know. But this is the power rankings right now. D5 leading the league at 14-2 and two with a four-win streak. Nice stuff. 64 survivals and 119 points scored throughout all weeks. BLP coming in second place. Man, I remember when they were sixth. Now they're second. 12-4 and four record, eight-win streak. Like I said, they haven't lost since eight since week eight. It's week 16. Eight plus eight, 16. That's eight wins. Eight-game win streak. 74 survivals leading the league in survivals and almost points, but Juggernaut has been having amazing games. They've been scoring mad fucking points. <clears throat> in third place is CLK. 10 and 6 record. Three losses. I don't know three loss streak. My goodness. But they have 55 survivals. And so they're barely above Juggernauts with 123 points. Speaking of Juggernaut, fourth place is 10 and 6 Jugs. Two win streak. 52 survivals with 136 points scored, leading the league in points. <clears throat> That's very nice. FC Kill Squad coming in fifth place. Of course, they're taking over AT's spot. AT spot. It's pretty huge for them. At a 9-7 and seven record pace. Four loss streak, though. And, I mean, they only lost two games since they came in. The other two losses were automatic losses given to them for the DQs to, I think, D5 and CLK. So they're, they're really on a two-loss streak, but four total because AT choked two games, just didn't want to play. 54 survivals, 86 points. D&D in sixth place with an 8-8 eight eight record. They've jumped up from... Uh, they were they were ninth in almost 10th place for the first half of the season. Now they're in sixth with an 8-8 eight eight record. The bounce back is insane. One win streak, 42 survivals with 74 points. You're messing up. DS is 12 and 14. Yeah, yeah, my fault. DS is actually 14 and 2. D5 is 2 and 14. Yeah, I'm stupid. My fault. Yeah, my fault. Uh, FM, 7th place, 7 and 9 record. One loss streak. They have 40 survivals and 94 points. Bomb in 8th with a 6 and 10 record. One win streak right now. 35 survivals and 86 points. Dynasty in 9th place at a 4 and 12 with one loss streak. 21 survivals, 56 points. And DS. 2 and 14 and 10th place. Four losses in, in the streak. 10 survivals and 57 points in the league. 
when the DS get the second win, we we uh, overturned that lost to AT. We the people that the the teams that lost to AT in the second half of the league weeks ten through I think like fourteen or whatever before they dropped out. I just reversed the win because we didn't think that we'd get another team back. And then FC Kill Squad joined, so I was like, ah, fuck it, whatever. I mean, look at them. FC Kill Squad's nine and seven. But to be honest, they'd be eleven and five right now if I didn't do that, and they'd be in third place. That's kind of wild, wouldn't it be? Am I hoeing FC FC Kill Squad? I don't know. Am I hoeing them? Am I hoeing them, bro? Am I hoeing them? Am I hoeing FC Kill Squad? Am I? Because it'd be 11 and 5 right now if I didn't do that. Speaking of, because two losses would go back as wins. So it'd be 11 and 5. I don't know. I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know. It'd still be a four loss streak right now, though, because, I mean. Um. What am I saying? Okay, yeah, but these are your power rankings, and uh, other than that, yeah, I think we're I think we're valid. Top twenty five has to get updated, but I haven't updated that since like week eight. Yeah, week seven. No, week eight. Yeah, bro, this is this is poverty. What have I done? What have I been doing? I'm actually such a shitter. I haven't updated this in in weeks. Oh, game playing guru. <laughs> okay, guys, uh, I'm I'm gonna try to get this top twenty five updated maybe this week. After this week, I will do it. I promise you. I will, I will see what I can do. Um, other than that though, the website is completely updated as always. Uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching the Gabcast. I'm going to go and uh, get some food, maybe, because I haven't eaten all day. My uh, my rations haven't come yet. <laughs> that guru guy's point maxing. Yeah, that, that guru guy point max. That guy's overall boosting, bro. I, that shit's wild. Bro's getting the 99. Bro's getting the first 100 overall. This gay playing guru. I'm 110 overall. Okay. Uh, guru soul FM like that. Okay, creamy. Thanks, bro. <laughs> I'll sub to you if you do. Come play with Crimson. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I do not know, chat. I do not know. I do not know. I do not know. All right. See you all tomorrow for three games in one night. That's going to be very fun. Peace out. Bye-bye. Good night, guys. Bye.